Hello there and welcome back to another episode of Going Medieval. Now in the previous episode we've had quite some quite some battles, so if we'll scroll down. We've got a few injured or recovering people in here. And we also have Craig uh, V that has now joined our colony, so welcome Craig. Uh, unfortunately, you got the colonist that is currently, uh, well, he's got a, let's see, a deep chest lacerations. And deep leg lacerations as well. So unfortunately, Greg, you're going to be down or in recovery mode for quite some time. Now, we've got uh, quite a few... Uh, I think that might have actually happened off the camera. Now, I don't think I was ro recording this last battle. But um, yeah, we've, we've got some new wep weapons, buddies. And uh, instead of taking them over there, I was thinking, why don't we build some buyers? So let's put a couple here. We can move them in the in the future, but let's put a few of them. I don't know, maybe six will do. And who's Polly? Where are you? I think he's coming over now. Uh, we'll build them here and we'll start burning those bodies rather than gathering them up up in there. Uh, Polly, are you coming over? Yes, you are. Good looking gamer. Oh, someone else is already constructing them. Sanchez is doing them all, it seems. Okay, how about you construct that one? And then Polly. Uh, right, he's already on top of that. Which is great. Now, we do have more resources here. We'd like to gather them all up. But we also have now finally built another one of these. Let's see. Uh, smelt items for metal. Flimsy. <laughs> yep, we're already doing that. So how about we do one more in here. We'll do all the flimsies. Uh, forever, please. All right. How much? How many bricks do we have? We got... Thousands. Okay, so that should be good. Now, no, I think I previously said as well that um, would like to use the clay bricks to build everything, but uh, um, we've already done it on the ground, and I've started to think, especially when I look at our great hall here. I hope it's already a great hall. Yes, it is. Um, I guess the it, it just looks a lot nicer if we mix it with the limestone. Limestone block walls, not walls, limestone blocks. There we go. If we mix them, I think we'll have much nicer results. So we'll just have to be clever about how we how we use them together. And uh, and yeah, okay, so we've got a few buyers ready. And let's edit this as well. We only want to burn enemies. So, and we'll do this forever. And we'll set up the same on the other ones as well. Let's not burn humans. Uh, by human, they mean um, people in our colony. Uh, yeah, that's exactly what it means. Okay, we've got it for all of them. And how about who's in here? Florence. Uh, someone's already uh, helping us out up there. And who's constructing that one? Sanchez, you're doing that one. Okay, so that's great. And now we see they're just putting in the fuel. Uh, Drake, are you doing one as well? Yes, he is. Fantastic. Let's get rid of those. All those enemies here. And forever. Sanchez, what are you doing now? Okay, so you're setting one up as well. That's fantastic. Everyone's working together on this. And I think they all agree. Let's get rid of all these enemies that we do not want to see in our colony. Oh, there's a nice long iron longsword here. So maybe it would be nice if we could store some of the better items. Sturdy. Hmm. The rest, I think. A uh, couple of flimsy bows in here. Yeah, I don't care about them too much. And while you look at that, we've got three of them working already. Another couple are being loaded up with corpses as well and that's beautiful and that's probably a much better way to get rid of those bodies than piling them here and I can't really remember if bones are useful for anything 
But for the time being, this just me uh, looks way more awesome. Yeah, so that's something we'll definitely gonna be using. There are a couple more bodies in here. What is it? Three, five, six, seven. So we'll either have to wait until these ones are done or we can build some more in the future. Now in today's episode, what I'd like to do is we've been building everything underground so far and we'll definitely keep doing that. However, uh, I think it will, uh, is about time that we start doing something above ground as well. So I would like to change this around just a little bit. Well, I can get the camera to stop bouncing up and down. Let's see, maybe straight through the middle. Let's do as many floors as we can. And then um, what we'll do is, oh, it's, uh, it's very difficult. My apologies. Yep, that's not working out. But essentially, we want to use those top uh, doors in here and turn this into um, like the main uh, entrance. Yeah, I think the bottom ones will leave it for a different purpose. Because if we go down, what I'd like to do is I'd like to surround the colony with two layers of walls. Uh, now the top one, the uh, top doors in here, they are going to give access to our uh, inner colony. And I think with the bottom ones, I'd like them to be some kind of like secret tunnels that go into the outer layers. Not entirely sure how we'll do this just yet, but I'm sure we'll find a way how to figure this out. So well, um, what's the time right now? Oh, it is evening already, so that's fine. We'll let them go to sleep, mind their business for a little bit, and then we'll uh, start constructing around this area a bit more as well. Um, what we'll also do is, I think the outside is going to be somewhere... A uh, quick autosave. Let's uh, check. We've got loads of sticks, a bit of wood. I don't think we have to worry about the limestone because there's plenty over here. One thing I would like to do though, if we hide the trees, I would like to limit the access for the enemies a little bit. For example, I don't... Oh, we can't check this, can we? I don't want them to have this shortcut option in here and here. I'd like this to be a, like a little safe island for us. And same when it goes down there. Actually, now that I think about it, Probably these two as well. And this one. Yeah. I think so. And then in the future we'll create a bit of a moat here. Uh, we'll mine through this area. But what else? I think the rest... Yeah, that can hold for the time being. And we'll speed up the time. Uh, what is the time now? 3am. Okay, so that's good. We'll mine this bit out so then... We can place the arches somewhere up there. Now, another thing I was thinking about is, let's see, we've got, um, oh, actually, getting a little sidetracked over here, but that's okay. Let's check the food real quick. Everything seems to be okay. Don't think we want those um, normal meals anymore. But we are going to take out all these, uh, these sections here, yeah. I would like them to eat in the Great Hall. Because that means if they spend a bit of time in here as well, they'll get a slightly higher mood buff. So we'll do just that. Research is available. Maybe we'll make some more books. I'd like to extend this zone in here. But also build another one just about here. So let, let's plan this out. So with these sections, we got four... That's another four, and then one in here. So how about we go... Maybe like so. We'll just go around the edges. Uh, so that's four, five, one, two, three, four, five, maybe this big. Yeah, that's a massive room. But then again, I think we're going to have quite uh, quite a lot of important things that we need. This could be for our tailors, where we make new different types of clothes. 
actually, you know what? Maybe maybe we don't want to go this far just yet. Let's let's keep it nice and cozy for the time being, and let's take a look at what research we can do as well. Uh, fletching, ooh, nice suppose, and then we could go with these ones. Crossbones would be really lovely. So is blacksmithing, to be honest. Oh well, let's go with some better bows. Give us a bit more range on on the enemies. And we'll add this in this in here real quick as well. Let's do bows until we have... Don't think we need 10, but we'll do 3. Actually, you know what? Same with you guys. Uh, we don't need that many bows. And Kuhist is already in action. Starting to construct a few. Okay, so we got the roads in. And um, I'm going to try and figure out a design in here. And put it in place. And as soon as we have a bit of a blueprint in, I'll be jumping right back. Alright, after some some planning, we have changed a few things around. So we dropped down a few levels. Now this probably took the most most of the time. I was just getting all the resources out of this way. And then we filled up we filled it up with walls. And now the stairs will go one level down from here to that same level and then straight to the uh, to the door. When it comes to the bottom level, uh, if we keep going down somewhere here, then this is all left open. And in the future, we will most likely tunnel our way through where our uh, outer layer is going to be. What's uh, going on here? Did I just notice something? Well, that was weird. His name was highlighted in red, so I thought he's... Paul is not happy, but no, it's the opposite. Paul is actually really enjoying his time in the colony. Well, anyways, coming back to here. So what I'm thinking is creating this inner circle of a couple of more important things. And this is where the main access to the colony is going to be as well. A lone traveler. Okay, we might be able to trade a few things, but let's just jump back in here. And then uh, we'll have a little tiny walls just going around the colony. Just to block ourselves in. Oh, Paul is just uh, getting ri rid of some of the plants that are interrupting our construction plans. And yeah, okay, so that's uh, that's kind of the plan. Uh, they're both the same distance, or at least should be. And then now what we can do is we can bring these roads all the way here. And then I think from... Uh, let us see. Should we take the limestone stairs? That actually might look nicer in here so yeah that's what we're gonna do we'll place a couple there as well and then connect them up with roads i think the outer layer should be somewhere around here in the future but for the time being we'll just leave it as it is we'll just put a few few roads down a few of these and i really want to move or remove all all of that construction there as well because it's uh, going to be uh, in our way a little bit right so when it comes to decorations i think we should put a couple of things down right off the start um maybe some some of these torches to allow us to see a little bit better and okay we're just going to construct yeah the sort of the outline of things first don't quite know where we want the doors just yet but I think if we leave uh, let's grab these walls again if we leave like a four a camp one two three four that's four and then we can bring it through like so we'll connect it up over there as well and we'll do the same one two three four bring it through oh we're missing just one and I think this forest uh yeah that's uh that's definitely going to move as well it's uh, it's a little bit in our way so we'll remove all that we have sticks oh logs might be going low but you know what i think now is a perfect time to cut down all these trees inside here because we also have this forest just out there okay fantastic everyone is asleep but uh, let's have, take a look. It took us a couple of days and we got quite a few notifications about things rotting away. 
Oh yeah, okay. So I think in the future, we'll probably have to extend this and make it a little bit bigger, but I, well, for the time being, well, we don't have a lot of barley in here. Uh, for the time being, we should be able to survive on, on what we, what we have. Oh, uh, okay. Mishandled the, the plants. That, that's okay. Uh, right in here, we shall start. Well, that's gonna have to be the same color as well, isn't it? Uh, or does it? I don't know. We're already doing it, so, oh well. And what we'll do is uh, we'll also have a few support beams if we can please construct them. And now we will just connect all this up. Maybe give them a bit more access there as well. Okay, so a few more tasks are queued up now. Cool, how is this looking outside? That is not bad at all. I think for the roads, what we'll do is we'll use the limestone floors. Actually, no. Let's uh, make it different color for the uh, for the roads up here. Ah, uh, well, do you know what? Let's do a quick test. So those Merlins, uh, what do we have? We put the clay one. How about we test? Oh, we are gonna need some roads now, don't we? Okay. How about brick in here and then limestone on that side? Now, are you gonna allow us to... Yes, that looks better. So one, and then... I guess the limestone block then. Oh, wrong one. Let's use R. Okay, as soon as they build those um, couple of sections, we'll be able to decide which which color should we, should we go with. And I think... Um, oh, actually, yeah. We should probably make this one level higher. Now that I think about it, oh, we have run out of, let's see, limestone. There is a bit of limestone there. What is our bench? Have we not constructed it? Oh, we have not. Okay, quick fix. We'll put you there. And let's do another bench then, because it seems we might have mm, taken it out without putting it back so how about how about we rebuild you real quick yeah did we not oh yeah we've, we've taken it out but forgot to put it back so well that's all right uh what are you saying uh we don't have the limestone bricks okay that's okay can someone <laughs> bully do you know what build this one that's a bit of a priority now and as soon as it's done we'll set up the the job queue as well you know what what he's also gonna help us if we build a bit of a stockpile here clear everything very high materials raw and limestone please fill this up with limestone that means it's gonna make us make it a little bit easier to start constructing all that in here. Uh, can we? One, two, three, four, five. Here we go. And now we would like to have a thousand. Yeah, a thousand should be enough in the in the reserves. Do you know what? Let's do a thousand five. A uh, hundred. So that way we'll have enough in stock. Okay. So it seems the outer layer is coming along quite nicely few flags will be actually pretty decent here as well and I've got the just the one in mind how about these two yep let's do that have we built those no just the floor uh well okay we're gonna have to wait for that but in the meanwhile I uh, just realized we sh might not have to mm, maybe we have to fill this up I was thinking of maybe to try and save just a little bit of that uh, limestone block since we are so low on them. But you know what? It's it's fine. Um, what I've also realized. Let's do these. Different color. Yep, we are going to take them down unfortunately. 
Um, I, th I think when it comes to the actual design, I'll probably have to think about it off the off the camera because it takes a very long time for me sometimes to really nail it down to the design that, that I'd like to see. And especially when playing with different types of walls as well to get the colors, colors in the looks right. But uh, yeah, we'll probably do it off camera now. Why are these weapons still in here? Uh, we do have enough storage here, don't we? Yeah, all sorts of war warfare is allowed. Ah, you lazy... Lazy people. Unless there's some uh, other good reasons why they haven't done it. Uh, yeah, it's not good. Good enough, I'm afraid, guys. Okay, we'll get those ones in. Uh, hopefully... Well, I'll see. I'll probably change them as well. Just to give it a bit of... Uh, variety. Now, is anyone... Oh, uh, we are gonna have to probably mine more limestone, don't we? Yep, that's pretty low as well, so... How about we mine out this whole section in in here? And the whole outside as well. Okay, so these are queued up. This limestone as well. That is limestone. That is limestone. Now, I don't think... Oh, no, they can still... Okay. Right. You're gonna have to come out. Mm, or do you? No, that can stay. But what I'd like to do is... Let's cut through here. So that way all the raiders will have to go around. Yep, and all the way from here as well. So that's good. Well, I think we'll take the same... Where is it? Here? Yep. It is there. And we'll take it down a level. We'll probably have to do the same in here. And we'll cut you out. Okay, good. Uh, new settler. Katarina, let's take a look at you. So, melee, medicine, animal, handling. Not the most useful ones, but as always... And uh, they are running away from enraged philosophers. Okay, so I don't think we're gonna get a raid. Now we can also check. Uh, do you know what? It's fine. And it does seem we have some spare beds available, so that's good. Right, is anyone making us some blocks? Do you know what? Schedule, Katarina. This is leisure and jobs wise. These should be the priority. Them ones too. And she doesn't really have a passion in anything. Yeah, so you're not gonna smith, tailor. Could all actually do a bit of crafting for us. Research, don't care too much. Uh, cooking, it's 20, so maybe we'll leave that. Cutting plants is fine as well. Mining... Uh, you know what, let's bring cooking to level 2. And I think all of these ones should be fine. Now, melee is very high. Marksman, I think you could be a melee person. Uh, yeah, you're gonna be a little warrior lady. If we can quickly check, no weapons. Uh, let's do something one-handed. We'll give you all shields. Uh, probably helmet. We'll definitely want you to have some sort of armor. And a barrel. Well, we're gonna change this in a little bit as well. Uh, well, great. Things are starting to look good. Another 19 hours until... Well, we might, might get some company. Yeah, I don't think they're very happy if we fight Katarina over here, but... We are definitely gonna fight for her, if it comes down to that. You know what, let's take some more limestone out from here as well. We will need some. Was there some on the other side as well? Okay, so there's still a bit there. And a huge amount here as well. Okay, yeah, I was right, so we got the wall in place now. So this one definitely does not stand out. So yeah, we uh, I think we're gonna go with the clay brick ones, and then we can do the limestone floors on top. So yeah, that's what we're gonna go with. 
Now for the top bit. Uh, do you know what? We'll spring it over. And... Ooh, yeah. A little low on the limestone end of things. But we, we'll do the pillars just like so. And probably have to... Yeah, we'll change them around later. Okay, so food-wise... We are decent. We've got enough stocked up for the winter, I believe. If only they could bring them in. Uh, do we have more? Oh, yeah, that's not looking good. Well, someone has to do a bit of cleaning up here. Uh, Katarina, since you weren't really passionate about anything, hopefully you will aid us in cleaning this mess up as well, because everyone else seems to be pretty lazy when it comes to cleaning out those shelves. Alright, we got six more hours until uh, our neighbors uh, shall arrive. How is this coming along? Very well, I'd say. Probably want to put some doors. Yeah, I'm thinking uh, maybe like so. And then we'll do a couple more walls. Uh, which one is it? Is this one, isn't it? Yeah, with the blocks. Okay, and the same. Uh, not this way, please. Let's spin it around. Here we go. So quite a few doors. Maybe we should have uh, probably change it over later. But yeah, that's a nice little room with some... Well, we can do some decorations in here. Maybe even stairs going up. No, that the stairs going up should not be by the main door because if they break through, that means they're going to have access to our defensive defensive walls, which I don't think we'll want them to have that. I guess the stairs could be from somewhere here. Yeah. Uh, here we go. We are... No. Okay, so we lost the alignment. I was kind of hoping they'll, they'll come and attack us, but oh well. So be it. If you're scared of us, then yeah. Um, <laughs> I guess you're scared of us, that's it. Uh, there wasn't anything any anything funnier I could come up with, so oh well. Uh, maybe we'll mine a bit more. That would be lovely. Has anyone started to mine that area up as well? No. Actually, do you know what, Katarina? Mining. Where is mining? Maybe this will go... No. No, we, we should have a couple of miners. Yeah, crafting and cleaning this place up would be preferable. And everyone's pretty happy right now, so that's, uh, that's good as well. Right, uh, I think along this wall as well, what we'll do to make this look a bit more unique is create these little sections in here that are kind of coming out from the wall. Let's see if there's four spaces. We could do another one in here. Just to make it look a little bit more special. And I think with all these buildings, we're gonna move them uh, somewhere else. And this inside might be good. With the farms, to make it a little bit more realistic, I think they're gonna be placed just outside the inner circle. I mean, back in medieval times, they wouldn't even be in the, in the inner uh, or the middle ring they'd be way outside of the castle walls but for this game uh if we do that and place those farms even further away i, I think we're we'll never we'll probably die of hunger yeah unless we somehow increase their how much they can carry each strip but um that means we'll have to look up some mods but yeah i, I think for the time being it's fine we we'll place a couple of farms inside the walls here so it's gonna be a little closer to us and maybe some other things can be further away and i'm thinking the same should probably be with the production buildings maybe farms on this side because there's soil here and then production can be here on the grass but it's not a huge priority right now so okay this over here is starting to look okay now we just need to give them a bit of access as well and put roads probably something like so let's just bring it all the way over yep they don't have access right now but as soon as they do that's when we will get up there 
Okay, so things are starting to look... Oh, yep, these angles are a little awkward. Alright, let's put a few decorations. Where are the flags? We will want one there, one there. And you know what? Let's do a couple of very big ones. Like so. Ah, oh, they can't reach them, can they? Access is painful in this game, honestly. Oh well, um, it's okay. We'll we'll figure figure out a way around this. It's just a minor inconvenience, but other than that, things are starting to look pretty pretty good, actually. Uh, right. So I think that's enough of constructing uh, things right now. I will carry on doing all this off camera. And hopefully in the next episode we'll have this a bit more uh, a bit more ready, I should say. Yeah, uh, I placed this in the wrong area as well. Oh, what a waste. Uh, yikes. Yep, uh, these are probably a good reason why I should do it off camera. A uh, little bit more so then um, we don't waste all those resources, but that's okay. Anyways, well... Thanks very much for joining uh, in this episode. I'm very, uh, very happy to see that there's still a few, few of you that do enjoy this game because I think it's a fantastic game. Yeah, just a little bit sad it's not as popular as some other games, but I really enjoy playing this, so I'll definitely carry on with this series as well. So once again, thank you for joining, and I hope to see you again in the next one. <laughs>